Oh, hello! Welcome to my makeup store. Yeah, see, we branch out. We have a spa and a hair place for you to do your hair. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My name is Lily. I'm the owner of all of this. Mm -hmm. The salon? It's, uh, yeah. You're in the wrong building, honey. <laughs> this is the uh, makeup store. Yeah, you need to go back from where you came in the exit. And the uh, building is two uh, buildings down. Mm hmm Yeah. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> But that's okay. The new girl is going to clean it, not me. Oh, hello. Welcome to my makeup store. How can I help you? Oh, you're looking for, um, the, oh, the Too Faced Snow Bunny? Uh, yes, it's right here. Yeah, it's I'm more ideal for very fair skin. You want to try it out? Okay, that's fine. I have it right in front of me. It's right here. Are you going to want it? So I don't have to bother putting it back. <laughs> um, hmm. You don't know yet. Okay, well, I'll put it right here, just in case you decide that you want it. So, this is a uh, tester of it. Yeah, see that's the lightest color there. And there's a little bronzy color. So, yeah, as you can see, this is very user-friendly. So, um, you really can't mess up. And if you happen to mess up, then that kind of means uh, you're an amateur. <laughs> okay, well. Hmm. What brush should I use? Hmm. No. We're going to use... This one. And I'm going to just put this here and tap it. Tap out the excess. You don't want to look a little <laughs> too much. So we're going to just do that. Mm -hmm. fair enough to wear it. Hmm. That... That looks good. Mm hmm I think that looks perfect. Mm hmm The mirror? Just turn. Turn around. The mirror's right there. Mm -hmm. Let me know what you think, if you want. The Snow Bunny bronzer. <clears throat> Do you want it? Oh, perfect. Okay, well. Oops. <laughs> there we go. I'm going to put it aside here, and uh, my associate will ring you up. Oh, great. 
Thank you for coming. Okay. Bye-bye. There you go. Hmm. Mallory Moonstone, how are you? Mm. Well, I'm going to say hi to you. Mm -hmm. Mm. You know, you're here very early. Aren't you supposed to be at work? Well, you look like a hot mess. I what could I say? Um, you look like you're about to read my, my palm with that little turban you got there. And those hoops are not helping, Mallory. Um, so, uh, what's troubling you today? Oh. Hmm. You had an outage? Well, that's very unfortunate. Um. Your liner looks like something um, Amy Winehouse would have applied. Mm. Yeah, I can see the eyeliner won that battle. <laughs> okay, darling. Um, you want me to do your makeup? Mm. Are you going to buy anything? I know, I know, we're friends, but uh, I'm here working, I'm making money, and uh, my time is money, okay, um, yeah, I have uh, this uh, Becca highlighter bronzing blush quad here. I could use this. You're about uh, a shade or two darker than I am. So you could pull this off. Um, and then, if you don't like the blush, I have a Bare Minerals one. It's uh, the Bare Minerals Gin Nude and the color Strike a Rose. It's very pretty. See? Like it? That's great. Then there's another one. Um, it looks kind of similar, but uh, this one is called Call My Blush. <laughs> yeah. This one is lighter, though. You see? You want this one? It's more work appropriate. <laughs> so, um, how is your, um, job going? Did you get that promotion? Mm, your boss still hasn't chosen. Hmm. Is that, um, what is that little project friend of yours called? Oh, Beatrice. How is she doing? Her face. Poor soul. Um, she really uh, needed a lot of attention. Um, I haven't seen her again, but she should pro purchase more of my products because that face needs a, a rescue. Yeah. Well, oh, she's nice? Well, if you say so. I don't know her. Saw her once. That's it. Well, okay, let's get to it. You're going to be late, you know that, right? 
Yeah, it sounds like you had one heck of a day. Well, since you've already started with your base, um, I would recheck that later because uh, you're looking a little cakey. I'm not going to fix it, no. I'm not going to be responsible for that. Well, you, you did that to yourself, Mallory. You want me to set your concealer? Yeah, I could do that. Okay, well, I'm going to get one of uh, hmm, my little brushes. This is the Hourglass Ambient Powders, and this one is in Def used light. Yes. I love it. That's what I have on. Okay. I have a habit of blowing the excess. I have to remember to tap. It's not hygienic. But, uh, old habits die hard. Okay, there we go. And we'll just look up. Mm. You need to redo that. That is, um, well, it looks decent now because this powder is extremely, extremely good. It can um, really save a disaster from happening underneath the eyes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that was that. And uh, you want some color. <laughs> Don't we all? Okay. Okay, now I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit. Now this one, this particular kit, is for fair skin. The other ones, I have them over there. Mm, I think this would work for you. Mm. Okay. We will do this. We will start with the cream highlighter because I only have this brush and uh, after I'm done with it I'm going to dip it in the contour shades well it's not my fault that you know <laughs> you're having a heck of a morning okay alright I think we're going to start with this one right did uh, really good. Hmm. You want me to do your nose? Okay, I'll do your nose. Hmm. Okay, we're going to do the contour shades now. Uh, this is me, and that looks about more you. never my forte. Um, do the fish face. Well, I mean, unless you want me to do a search party for your cheekbones, uh, I might miss. And um, that's not going to be cute. Okay? Do the fish. You know. Suck those cheeks in. I think I'm doing good on this. 
I really? Yeah, I think so. I'm not contouring your nose. No. No, no. I'm not doing that. Like I said, I'm not a professional. I'm a businesswoman. I'm only here because the new girl I'm hiring is starting next week. So I'm trying to hold everything together. Mm. The new girl? Well, she's a bit odd, honestly. Um, I had two girls apply for the position, and um, she was the one that did the best job. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, she did my makeup. The other one did her my makeup, and uh, hmm, let's just say I, I was less than impressed. You're not impressed with it? Well, you know what? I will tell you something, Miss Lemon. Um, it was either this look or the other look that the other girl did. She left me looking a little bit like I was a contestant on the RuPaul's Drag Race. Mm -hmm. So, needless to say, as soon as she left, I could not remove the makeup fast enough because that situation, I don't wish it on my worst enemy. Now, the new girl? Well, her name is Esmeralda. She has a fascination with uh, shiny things and she just, she dresses very oddly. Everything's sparkly, she just like, yeah, she was admiring my, my jewelry. Yeah, see? And then my earrings. Yeah, she was, she was just saying how beautifully uh, they sparkled. Yeah. And she walks around with this locket, this long gold heart-shaped locket. You know how people have a, um, they call those these emotional uh, pet dogs, animals, emotional um, support animals. Well, her support object is that locket. Yeah, she carries that locket everywhere. Yeah, you know, she even had the audacity to to say to me, well, actually to ask me, not actually ask me, but she, she said, she asked me, um, I would, I would like for you to give me these earrings and your ring. Can I have it? I thought to myself, you are a very bold, oddly person. <laughs> but I told her no, obviously. <laughs> I'm not giving her these. No. No, no, no. Yeah, and then for some odd reason, she started swinging that weird locket. Yeah. I mean, she did a, a decent job on my face, but she kept looking at my ring. Hmm. Yeah, that was very odd. But uh, I didn't have enough people applying for this position. I don't know why, but I have people who gave me this reputation of being obnoxious. So not many people wanted to apply for this position. Why is she starting next week and not tomorrow? Mm, well, she said that she had to go to court. I, well, it was a uh, restraining order issue. Her, um, she said her place of employment, um, took her to court to, uh, put a restraining order against her. 
<clears throat> I know, it sounds a bit crazy, I know, but uh, I didn't want my customers, my clients, to be leaving my establishment looking like drag queens. Do you understand, Mallory? I mean, what could I do? The other girl wasn't strange, but her makeup skills just were not up to par. No, no, no. No, we can't. Um, okay, well, the next thing we have to do is do your eye makeup. Mm-hmm. What palette? Okay, there's two palettes that I was thinking of. There is the, um, Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics or the Anastasia Beverly Hills Sultry Palette. Which one? You want the Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Palette? Basics Palette? Okay, well, I agree. I agree. Because uh, you're going to work. And you already look like, you know, Madame Cleo's assistant. We don't want to make it worse by giving you dark eyeshadows and everything. Glitter and everything. <sighs> Mallory, next time you decide to take up my time, because, like I said, time is money. <sighs> Call me, please. <laughs> because if the customer comes, I'm just going to drop you like a fly. Okay? <sighs> Alright. There is two eyeshadows. I like to set that issue there. One is a lighter gold. Well, hmm, it's not gold, but like a, a bright yellow. And one's like a beigey color. Beigey cream color, I don't know. Like I said, makeup is not my forte. I'm only here because I have to be. I like to be in the skincare department. That's my thing. I know my hair looks not best. She tried to, um, apply for the salon. Uh, let's just say that this is not going to get you a position in my salon. But, um, I didn't have time to correct it because I have to sit here until the makeup store closes. <laughs> okay, well, you look like this eyeshadow. What's the eyeshadow called? It's called Blow. And the other one was called Pregame. <laughs> the other one seems that it's going to um, be a little bright. Only because, you know, you're not as fair as I am. You're a little tanner than me. So I think that this would be ideal for you. Okay, close those eyes and we shall start. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that was a good shade. Um, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Yep, that works. Since you're wearing a blue-black dress, I can do this color. It is uh, called Magnet. It's a crease color. But I need to do a uh, 
What do they call that? Mid-tone shade? Well, you know, Miss Cosmetic Queen. You're miserable at your job because I did tell you that you could open up all this with me after we graduated mm -hmm, from the university. Yeah? But no, you wanted to be an executive. Hmm. CEO. Well, how is it going? Hmm. Not so good, right? So you'd be running this place with me. Mm hmm. You'd be happier because you and I were like this. We are very similar. And nobody understands us like we understand each other. But that's your problem now. Well, you know, you can always still come here and work for me. Partners? Well, I love you. We're like sisters. But uh, I don't know about that. You would have to just go through the ropes and see if uh, you're up for it. You want to bring Beatrice with you? What is she going to be, your assistant? Because she's not going to be doing skincare. Not with that face. No, darling. Mm -mm. And the makeup. Can she even apply eyeliner? I don't know about that. Mm. And the salon. I seriously doubt that she can do hair. Yeah, that hair looks like she's related to the Lion King. That hair is unruly. No, that... Mm, no, 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 no. She will be your responsibility. Oh, she's good with the books. Well, as long as people do not see her, I think we could work something out. Yeah, I think we could work something out. Just don't have her around people. Because because she's a little awkward. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure she's a good person. But uh, that good person face is not going to bring me profit if people see her. Okay, now Let's continue before you're extremely late and you get fired. Okay. We're going to use this color called Tempted. We're going to go from light to dark so I don't have to waste all my good brushes, majority of my good brushes and all that. Okay. Okay. Close. That's good. Hmm. Very nice. And uh, blend, blend that real good. Um, hmm. That kind of works. <sighs> Mallory, I'm trying here. Just relax, you're going to look decent. Um, not great, but you're going to look like a decent human being. Okay. Alright, next color is going to be Lockout. that eyeliner because that Amy Winehouse look is not cute. But see, I'm not going to do it. No. Do you see me doing eyeliner? I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. 
Now we're going to do some color here under the under eye to, I guess, what they call that? Definition? Yes, that's what it's called. Definition. And uh, what brush are we going to use for that? Oh, I don't have the appropriate brush, so... Oh, aren't you out of luck? Okay, I'm going to use this side. <laughs> okay, start praying because uh, that's a very thick brush right there. But uh, I'll go slow. I'll go slow, slow, slow. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Now, brace yourself, look up, and pray. Okay. Oh. Mm. Keep looking up. That, um, mm. well, let's just say that it looks like Amy Winehouse did the lower lash line. It matches the um, the thickness of, uh, of the uh, eyeliner that you applied, that you're guilty of applying. I just uh, I just matched the thickness of it. Um, yeah, you might get need a wipey and um, kind of thin that out a bit. That's just uh, a little bit much, but at least. You still look like a decent human being slash panda. <laughs> but a cute panda, what can I say? All right. Oh. Oh. All right. Um, so you wanted this blush, right? The, uh, what was it? Striker Rose? Or was it the other one? Hmm. Let's look. Nope. No, it wasn't this one. It was this one. Alright. We're going to... Hmm. We're going to do this brush. We're going to use this one. It's smaller. Less intimidating. Well, I need complete control because um uh yeah that's that's a bit much okay Brush looks great, and your eyeshadow, it looks okay. Hmm, it looks okay. Hmm. Um, you want highlighter? Well, aren't you a little princess today? Um, I'm not that great with highlighter. We're going to do the Becca highlighter. Um, let's see. We're going to try. Do you want a peachy gold, or would you like a soft gold? A soft gold. Okay, that's fine by me. Now we're just. Going to put that on that little right part right there. And do that side. I could do your nose, but uh, if you're starting to look like Rudolph did your highlighter, but that's okay. That's, that's up to you. Hmm. Might as well finish the Picasso that you did on your face this morning, right? 
that looks shiny. <laughs> All right, my dear. You want glitter? I thought you were going to work. I mean, you're already shining here and here. I mean, where else? You want to try this? Well, this is the uh, Glitter and Glow Highlighter in here. Oh, yeah. That's what that's called. And the color is called... Monarch. I mean, I could put it on you, but I don't think that's a good idea. I mean, you... And I'm saying this because out of love and, and care, right? Yeah, you know that we're, we're good friends for over 20 years, right? I am... If you put glitter with all this highlight mm -hmm, and that Amy Winehouse situation going on, I think you're going to look like a stripper going to work. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, you're going to look like a stripper. I'm just saying, I know I'm not the, the expert when it comes to makeup, but at least, see, the thing is, I know what uh, doesn't look appropriate. And let me tell you, stripper glitter is not appropriate for work, okay? Hmm, okay. I will do it. Well, what am I doing for my um, upcoming milestone birthday? Um, you mean my 25th birthday? <laughs> no. No, I am not that age. Mm -mm. I am not turning that age. Mm -mm. See, this place is the... Uh, Fountain of Youth. I'm always 25. I look it, honey. And that's what I say. If you say you're that age, that's your problem. But do not include me. Mm -hmm. No. I take care of my skin. How about you? Um. I'm going to just tell you this. We're friends. You've known me for a very long time. Do not go around saying that number and include my name on it. Because I will be highly upset and I will deny it. Mm -hmm. I will deny. And if you appreciate and uh, value our friendship. You will keep quiet. Shh. Quiet. All right. So, you want to look like a stripper? Here we go. Close your eyes. yourself 180 degrees and then you will find the mirror right behind you mm -hmm. so do you like your makeup oh not your best well what can I say the canvas wasn't all that great for me to start with 
Okay, well, you have a great day, and I'm going to stay here and uh, make money. <sighs> yeah, until the new girl comes around. No, oh, yeah, you just have to meet her. Yeah, she is a character. Yeah. Hmm. Her and her little emotional locket. A little thing that she uses. Yeah. She likes to swing it around like it's going to do something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. See, she could be very bizarre and odd, but at least I won't be sitting here. It's going to be someone else and I can do what I enjoy. And that is skincare and making people beautiful from the inside out. Mm. Yeah, because, you know, we have a beautiful heart. You know that. Mm -hmm. Mm. Okay, Mallory. Well, you take care, honey. And uh, if you need me, just give me a call before you get here and um, just not let me earn my money. Um, there's customers coming, honey, so you need to uh, skadoodle, okay? Bye-bye. See you next time. Hmm.